Yes guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today uh, this is a message to UEFA about the Hungary fans and there's not it's not just about last night, it's about other stuff as well, about, about what the Hungary fans have done in the past as well, but uh, obviously during the European Championships and just other stuff as well. But uh, yeah, make sure to smash the like button and subscribe. So let's get into this video. And, uh, yeah, so obviously the, well, let's just start with last night. And obviously, last night, the, uh, the, obviously last night, it was England versus Hungary in a World Cup qualifier. And, uh, um, it was in the away end, I don't know what minute it was in, but it was in the around, I don't, I don't know what minute it was in, but, uh, a Hungary fan was racist to one of the England stewards in the away end and the steward told the police and then the police went to go deal with that Hungary fan. I think at first they told the Hungary fan just to go, you know, just to go uh, kick him out of the stadium and uh, I just told him to go kick him out of the stadium and uh, the the fan said no, like he wasn't having it. So I don't know what happened. I think I think that he pushed the police, or the police pushed him first. It was one of the two, and then it was it, and then it just all kicked off from there. Um, and then obviously the police. There was that there was that many Hungary fans. The police had to retreat uh, back. You know, back where the. Uh, back where the, uh, the the fans bit is. But I don't know where the fans are, if you get what I mean. And, uh, and uh, yeah, and obviously, the hungry fans for that violent and dangerous, they obviously, sorry, but yeah, they, uh, they obviously had to retreat and obviously, yeah, so obviously that's one thing. And also, the Hungary manager, you are the absolute. Oh my God! Flipping out. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Come here. Flipping out. That scared me. Yeah, sorry about that. That's a dog, but uh, yeah, as I was saying, the uh, the Hungary manager, he is a joke. He is a joke, in my opinion. So the reporter asks him about the stuff last night, last night. And he said, no comment. You are a joke. I know, like, you're probably thinking, how's it a joke? He said, no comment, just want to talk about it. But, like, you're the manager of the Hungary national football team. You are the manager of the Hungary national football team. It just proves that you don't care about the fans. You just want your fans to be racist to other players. Get in life, man. It's just an absolute joke. But, uh, yeah, and obviously, let's just go. And then, obviously, we have already have played Hungary before. We played them in Budapest at the Puskas Arena. And uh, we won 4 0, England. And Raheem Sterling and Drew Bellingham, targeted of racism, guess who? By the Hungary fans. The Hungary fans were racist. And also, in the European Championships as well, 20, Euro 2020, Hungary versus France, a packed, full Puskas Arena. The Hungary fans were racist during that game in the Euros. And this is just my message to UEFA. I know it's only like three games, England at Wembley, England at the Puskas Arena, and against France in the European Championships. But like, like you should be you should be doing something. You should be doing something better. Like, you should, like, they need to, they need to ban, they need to ban the Hungary fans. Like, ban them, ban them for, like, a year. And then, I think what you even need to do, yeah, is ban the Hungary fans for a year. And then if it doesn't work, just... Just ban, like, ban all the Hungary fans. And then, 
Now, to be fair, it's not really all the Hungary fans. It's like a certain section of the ground where the racism is happening. So, like, I think, I think, first of all, just ban those people who are racist. And then if those other fans who, you know, are not a part of that thing are racist, just ban them. Just ban the whole crowd for a year. And then if they're still racist after that year, just ban them for life. That's what I would do. Because if you keep... I know racism isn't going to stop. It's, it's just not going to stop. We all have to admit that it's not going to stop. But if you just keep on... If, oh, my God, I need to drop my phone. But, yeah, if you keep on being racist and racist and racist, you're just going to get banned and banned and banned and banned, and then eventually you'll be banned for life, and then you can never go and watch a football game again. That's what happened with, the, with like a Bulgarian fan or something. But, uh, yeah, for me, that's what I would do. And you UEFA, you're probably not... They're not, not going to watch this video, but you UEFA, you need to do something about it. And so do you, the Hungarian FA. You need to do it something about it because you can't just let it go on because it's not fair it's not fair it's not fair but anyway i'm gonna end the video here so yeah this will be out soon as you know i'm at the park so uh yeah i'll see you in a bit